Did you know that digital marketing has a dirty little secret that not many people are talking about? Well, stick around. That's what I'm talking about today on Quick Tips Tuesday. Welcome back everyone. I am so glad that you're here. Today I wanna to talk about digital marketing's dirty little secret. And it's something that you don't hear a lot about, but it is something that affects every single person that is working in the digital marketing space. Wouldn't you like to know what that dirty little secret is? I'm gonna tell you about it. But first I wanna tell you about how I figured it out. Here's the deal. When I first got started, I'm a web developer, right? And I spent a lot of time trying to figure out how to build an online business. I see lots of offers and lots of different things that are going on online, lots of different products and services that people wanted me to buy. And the one thing that was common among all of them, it seems, is faster, better, cheaper, easier. And so I would jump in with both feet and I would do my best to figure out how I could put this particular system into use or I could make use of this great tool to be able to do SEO research or to make use of whatever you know system is out there that somebody's promoting that's supposed to help me to blast off my marketing uh, efforts and all of the things that I'm trying to do online. But what I found out is quickly and, and found it out the hard way, just as you probably figured it out too, and you may not even know that you know it, but digital marketing's dirty little secret is it takes a lot of really freaking hard work to make progress and to get things done. Just know when you're getting started that it takes hard work and commitment to get it done. I'm just getting back from Funnel Hacking Live in Nashville, and I spent the last several days there with the world's most brilliant marketers learning tons of great things. But there was a common theme that was among them all. If you're going to be able to make the breakthrough that you want to make, that you are going to have to be dedicated. You're going to have to be committed. You're going to have to be all in all the time if you want to be able to make the breakthrough that you are trying to make for your online business. It takes commitment, it takes dedication, it takes hard work in order to be able to do this stuff. You gotta commit to doing it every single day. You've gotta commit to shipping every single day. You have to commit to publishing. You have to commit to pushing through the hard times. You've gotta commit to making things happen on a regular basis. Tony Robbins was the last speaker to go during Funnel Hacking Live, and he pointed out a story about Sarah Blakely, and I won't get into all of the details about everything that went along with that, but the bottom line was that she was so committed to making her product work and it took her years of hard work and commitment and dedication far beyond when most other people would have quit. So that's the secret it is commitment and dedication. But then there's another side to this, right? So the, the even more closely guarded secret is that you have to really believe in what you're doing because if you don't have a big enough why your reason for doing this your purpose your mission for why you're trying to build a business online then you are not going to get there you have to believe that the world needs to see what it is that you are trying to ship because otherwise you're not going to stick with it when it gets hard you're going to be the one who quits when it gets tough you're not going to be the the one who pushes through like you're not going to be the one to keep knocking on doors you're not going to be the one to keep picking up the phone and making the calls you're not going to be the one that is going to keep persisting and refining and working and and adjusting and tweaking and trying to make things work if you don't really believe that what you have is something that the world needs to hear i hope that helps i hope that inspires you because for me it, it, it does inspire me i want to help people break through and, and build freedom into their life. It's the reason I create these videos. It's the reason and the motivation behind the services that I have in my business. And it's the reason that I do what I do. I want people to be able to break free and be able to build margin into their lives. They want I want them to be able to 
build freedom and financial freedom and be able to set their own sail for what they want their life to be. So when things get going and they're they're tough for me, I remember why I'm doing this and how I'm trying to make my contribution and I keep shipping because the why is more important than any of the hows. It's more important than any of the tools. It's more important than any of the resources that are available to you out there. There has to be this insatiable hunger that you have, that you're going to be willing to push through, to go anywhere, to give up everything, to do absolutely whatever it takes to see your goal accomplished. And it doesn't matter, words don't matter. I could be one of these people that's talking about, hey, I'm gonna be on stage next year for the Two Comma Club. I heard lots of people talking about that. Words are cheap. Action is what matters. Doing things and, and taking the next step, shipping, making things happen, refine, revise, repeat, and ship. That's what we need to be focused on. So number one, it's a lot of hard work. Number two, you got to really believe in what you're doing. It has to be a burning desire, it has to be an insatiable hunger, it has to wake you up in the middle of the night and has to get you out of bed in the morning when long before anybody else gets up. Without those, without any of those things, your blog is never gonna go. Your website is never gonna go. Your, your online business is never gonna happen. It's never going to achieve what it could achieve without the hunger, without the commitment, without the desire and the motivation to push through. So that's what I've got for you guys today. Make sure you hit subscribe. Make sure, give me a like on this video. Let me know. I wanna hear from you what you're working on. What are you doing and how are you motivating yourself to get through and push yourself to the next level? Until next time, we'll talk to you later. Bye.